it was an incredible experience to be around people who are loving and supportive and everybody is working like i felt like a star everybody's working for me and what's best for me i hate to perform and i tend to forget everything however with all this love and encouragement i did it well, your dance definitely is so much fun and he he makes it look easy of course definitely it was a pleasure to work with him he's so much fun he's very patient and uh, he's not judgmental so this is very very important if you just listen get inspired start in the same place like even though when i thought i'm like oh my god i look so stupid and i'm not doing it right and he was very encouraging and saying no you're getting there you're doing this good you're doing that good so the feedback was very very helpful and i really liked that about him it was intense and it was worth it and i'm so excited that i did it I thought at the beginning it was not going to be that intense. And as I mentioned before, I had some background on Afro-Cuban and Rumba Wawanko, but Rumba Colombia, definitely, absolutely different story. My biggest fear was um, I was worried that I'm not going to understand the music. And uh, to follow the clave or I didn't even know which part of the music should I focus on and when do I do this clave or I didn't even know which part of the music should I focus on and when do I do this move or that move so I was like absolutely clueless when I first listened to the music and I'm like I can hear this I can hear that but definitely your dad made it uh, much more easier for me to uh, to focus on one um, instrument or one type of music so where I can move my body to certain type of uh, clave or any other instrument. Uh, you told the step that I took you to before I used to see all those professional dancers doing those moves that I wasn't sure what it is and how um, where did it came from because it wasn't Afro-Cuban or Rumba Wawanko and now that I that I learn it and I can uh, and I see where did it come from and I'm gonna add it to my um, freestyling <laughs> So now I feel confident that I can incorporate these moves into my freestyling. And when I did the, the final performance, I had to call, of course, my best friends.
I did it! Finally, I managed to do the final performance. I was so nervous and with all the stress and everything else. Now, I'm relieved. I'm sad that it's done, but I'm definitely relieved. Working with the team with Abanico Dance, it was an incredible experience. Definitely recommend this program to you and uh, just learning something new. It will give you that hope that you need to wake up in the morning or wait for that day to come, that you can do something different in your, in your day today and it will affect the rest of your week. Your Dan, thank you so much. I really appreciate your time the fun that we had together. There's more to go, but I really, really appreciate you and I appreciate your time and the encouragement that you gave me. Uh, you're such an amazing instructor. Thank you so much.